All right, y'all, your boy got a new toy. Let's see if we can get these batteries in before night is upon us. Where am I gonna set this phone? Now, it's ideally, be. it'll be. I would have the app on the phone. You used to have the app on the phone back in the day. These batteries are 60 pounds a piece. I need four of them. I have four of them. Oh, no. oh. This is the little inverter I use for my laptop and everything. Can put that there. I meant to get some washes because these are pretty worn out. I need to replace these. Pretty sure this phone is gonna hit the ground before we finish here today. Nonetheless, let's get rocking. Put that out of my way. We got to move expeditiously. 16. There we go. Is it 916? No, 716. Woo, I'm off. Question you might have is where's the best place to get batteries? Hervey, I have a silly idea that you might have already given a spoiler well, away with the answer to that question. Raleigh's has them. I do this one at a time. Hey. One at a time. How else are you gonna do it with one at a time? I mean one battery at a time. Maybe two at the most. Do not just take all of these things loose and put them back. It's really yeah, it's hard to mix up, but just to keep it simple. Make sure you put it in turn the right way and connect the right post up the right cable up to the right post connect the cable up to the right post now this is still connected so you don't want to be be careful with your touch that might be the problem but i got them now so yeah there is a lesson for you mm -hmm. if your battery is having an issue of going dead a lot. Make sure these things ain't vibrated loose. Silly goose me. Should have been the first thing I checked. Mm -hmm. You shouldn't be reaching over like this to remove this battery. If my back is hurting tomorrow, I did it to myself. Am I blocking the view? Cause this is how you hurt your back. Bending over, lifting weight, and bending over with it. Not supposed to do that. I should have left that one out and put this one in. Would have been a lot easier. What I'm trying to do is keep my shirt from getting dirty. Y'all know this is my favorite shirt. No need in putting it off. What must be done, must be done. The battery to the far right has a lot of cables coming from the cab over the corner of the battery. He needs to take the battery on the left out first. Then it will be easier to slide the battery on the right out. Then he can slide the new battery back in on the right first before replacing the battery to the left of it. Set this on the ground out of the way. <clears throat> Ooh, boy. boy got a little weak. Got a little weak right now. Now, we 
be in there now. Let me go ahead and put that one. Got a lick now, baby. I still had a cap on it. Got her licked now. Negative, negative, yep. Take this cap off, take this cap off. You want these to be sitting flush. Make sure nothing fell in there. I had that cap that fell in there. Cause they're already gonna be vibrating enough, as you can see. The other one came loose. So they're gonna be doing enough vibrating. You don't want them to, to be sitting on top of something. So they had these batteries, had O'Reilly's. Oh, yeah. For like 150, 160, 170. They had them at AutoZone, I mean, Advanced Auto, about 180, I think. Guess how much it was at Freightliner. Freightliner has redeemed itself. I'm talking about in a big way, though. Cause these batteries were $95 each at Freightliner. But what happened was, I asked them how much they were. And he told me 79. So then I was like, wow, get out. Let's go. Put them on my account now. And so then I went and paid on my account while he was ringing this stuff up. And when I came back, when I came back, I said, what happened? Did, did batteries? Oh, I was just joking. I said, batteries went up, didn't it? Because last time I got, got some, it was $86. But remember, I just told you I was quoted $150, $160. Actually, I found those online over there. They tried to tell me that the batteries was $335 because they were trying to sell me the AMG batteries, the new and improved batteries. Supposed to last for 10 years, but I don't need it for 10 years. I wanted the cheaper batteries, the 150 something. The same ones that came out is what I wanted. So I was expecting him, I mean, yeah, I was going to Freightliner expecting him to be to cost even more. So I was like, I was playing, I was like, oh, batteries don't went up, didn't it? He's like, yeah, actually they did, but I told you 79, so that's the price I gotta honor. Yeah, that's what happened. The batteries were actually $95. I don't know if I said that yet. But, but because he had, they went up to 95, they were 79, last he know. So that's the price he told me. But when he checked, it had went up to 95. But he ain't even, he ain't even tripped. He just gave it to me for 79. But that ain't even all. It's $35 core charge that I get back when I bring the dead batteries back. So they, they, they was only what, $40, $45. Wonderful. That's why when I saw this, wasn't tight and that might be the reason that it wouldn't start reliably i ain't even stopped i just went on kept on getting it because for the batteries to be that cheap and i'm getting that kind of a deal i might as well go ahead on and replace them right well that's what you get for working in the dark you go over there to oh Home Depot by midnight. He lost his last nut. Take one of these with me. Home Depot. You got what you need. So here's a big tip for you. Not like you need to be told it. Always put on your work clothes. <laughs> Don't think you could do any 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 type of mechanical work and not get dirty. I think I have ruined my shorts. 
which I really thought, well, okay, now, yeah, the shirt too. But I had assumed that I'm probably gonna end up ruining the shirt, not the shorts as well. Guys, it was about time for that shirt to retire anyway, don't you think? I know y'all get tired of seeing him wear that shirt. Told me today he's going to get the same words printed on his other yellow shirt. I said, no, Hervey, you didn't need to be let told it go. That, did you? At least think of another phrase. He yeah, said, so. okay, maybe. I said, awesome. 20 cents. That was a 20 cent, 20 minute fumble, losing that nut. I'll tell you another big lesson, if you want it. Start working on things with plenty of time, plenty of daylight left. You think it's gonna take 20 minutes? It's gonna take an hour and 20. You think it's gonna take a half an hour? It's gonna take two. So I'll give yourself plenty of time. I was pushing it because I was editing the video. I didn't want to stop. Guys, and he saved enough process, with these batteries buddy. to buy a share of NVIDIA on Get sale. You think he did? No, he bought December 2026 call options of Ford with a $15 strike hey, hey. at 62 cents. At we got her done. Ford. We Talking about it, it was too tomorrow, close to we? its 52 week we low. Got her done. Hervey, do you have a Ford fetish? You drive a Camry. That's a Toyota. All of these nuts well, he did sure get nice TQQQ options last week on the dip, too. He's up on both, but it still didn't make up for the $3,000 lost on SQQQ the week prior because he paper handed the trade. Could have made a profit if he had held right, it till Monday. Bless his heart.